¡Ey! ¡Ja! ¡Viva España! ¡Feliz Día Nacional a todos los españoles en todo el mundo! Espero que vais a celebrar súper bien. Aquí no vamos a hacer mucho de nada porque aquí la situación todavía es un poco grave. Así que no pasa nada, ¿no? Mañana es otro día. Hi everybody! Happy Spanish National Holiday! As it is where I live, I thought I would throw this in as well and wish the country that has been so generous, so kind, so welcoming to my children, to me from Jump Street 30 years ago. I just want to say happy, happy National Holiday and I hope that everybody is going to be celebrating in a safe manner so that things don't continue to get worse here. And then, having said all that, I do have something to show you because this sheath here is my Chunye, good life, number one. How about that, no? Good life on a day like this. And look, it looks like a massive, massive pea pod. Oh, it's fat and chubby. And because it's somewhat dried, I'm not gonna snip it open. The strength of these buds, they are pushing fast. They're going to come through there with no need for my intervention whatsoever. Junior Good Life, we will be seeing that soon on a day like this. Why not celebrate some buds in sheath? And that includes my Catlia Dinard Blue Heaven. Can you see it? Can you see that? I think you can tell what's in there. Yeah. So repotting, being drastic on the root ball while it was in sheath and the sheath was still green, which then quickly changed after the repotting. And I thought, well, maybe I forfeited the blooms for this year, but no way. Ta-da! Something is on the way. So that's another thing to celebrate on a day like this and I wanted to share that with you as well. And then I wanted to show you my flamingos. The flamingos are over there, I'll get to them. I, how can I forget my Coilo Stylus Ciliaris cross with Brassavola Digbiana. Recently also repotted while in sheath and not skipping a beat here. And this one is the biggest tease of all because we have one sheath, then she has another sheath in that sheath, that's right here to the left. And then she's putting out another sheath and it will continue like this for another couple of weeks, one sheath after the other, and you're kind of wondering what and when is she going to bloom? But that's her nature, so we shall be seeing her probably in about, oh, I think this is gonna take five weeks. <laughs> she's a tease. And so am I, because I keep talking about flamingos, so let's go over there. This is not the flamingo, but initially I thought I would only film this one because I couldn't see much of anything else going on while planning this video, which has been a long time because I had to do all the graphics and everything. But <laughs> I am so distracted, I'm so sorry. This is my Angraecum leonis. And I can assure you that I was so jealous of Attainable Green and the Orchid Room. And I was hoping that one day the ladies would be done with horking all the buds and blooms of a Leonis. And I think they are done because they have sent me a spike. We have gotten to spiking point with my Angraecum Leonis number one. I have two, but here's my uh, first one that I bought. And I don't know what took a little bite out of it. And look who's here. Look who's come to join us on this national holiday. Baluski. Don Baluski. Hola. <laughs> when I am down on the floor, Baluski is right behind me. Are you going to say hi? No barking when mom's away, huh? <laughs> back to, yes, you're, you're cute. Now back to this, because that's cute too. So something's been chomping away at it. I don't know. It just sort of had a little bit of a graze and said, nah, don't like it and moved on. And that has stopped there. There's no nothing spreading there. So I'm really relieved about that. But yeah, Leones, oh la la. 
so happy to see this. I shouldn't be saying oh la la, we are in Spain and today is the national holiday of Spain, so ole! And a very special day that my flamingos have opened up. Look, this is what I call my flamingos because when Lelia perinii is in bud, it is incredible that she has this shape of a flamingo beak. So today they're just a little bit already too far open, but still, I call her my flamingo. And if she gives me more than one bloom, she's my flamingos. Check this out. Today, Lelia perinii decides to open. So there's still a little bit of wrinkling and creasing and all that going on but that is normal. She has to come out of her form and into form. But yeah, look at that. On a very special day, I have some very special blooms opening. So pretty. And I have a feeling they're gonna look much nicer than they did last year. So this is day one and I am now counting to see how long she is going to be open because last year I only got her for 11 days. Ah, uh, so gorgeous, but we will see her again because she has also been allocated in honor of Spain as well. And as a congratulations, what colors come to mind? I have the perfect orchid for that. So this is my Epicat Leia Gold Coast Sun Kiss. And isn't that just the perfect embodiment for Spain? the national flag in an orchid. I'm very fortunate that I have her available in bloom this time of year, otherwise I would have inserted the picture. But this is stunning, to say the least. This pom-pom of gorgeous, gorgeous colors. Absolutely the reflection of the Spanish flag in an orchid bloom. It's perfect. There is no fragrance. There never has been, no matter how much sun she gets. As you can see, we made the mistake last year. So no way, I can't see a better and a more fitting orchid than my Epicatlia Gold Coast Sun Kiss to say thank you also to Spain for being such wonderful hosts to my children and I. I really appreciate your hospitality and the passion and the love, the care, the concern, the friendships, everything about this country makes me feel I belong here. But wait when we come to the Kenya national holiday. <laughs> anyway, I hope everybody celebrates this day, if they celebrate this day, and that they stay safe, that they stay responsible and sensible, please. We don't want any more of this nonsense to spread and have a wonderful day. Ole! Amigos, para siempre y siempre un placer. Adiós, que tenéis un buen día. Hasta luego. Mm -hmm.